experience a New Year's drop in the comfort of your own home. Molly is live with a local business helping to bring uh, helping you celebrate 2024. Hey, Molly. <laughs> Yeah, if you really want to make 2024 pop, then literally we've got something for you. So this is a pop drop balloon. Oh, wow. Uh, we're going to explain what this is. This is Amelia. She has a business called Balloons by Bees. Bees is a childhood nickname. Uh, and Amelia, you do, uh, you know, balloon art throughout the year. Lots of arches, photo ops, uh, different things like that. This is something you've been making the past two years. Talk a little bit about what the pop drop is. Yeah, so this is, it's an 18 inch balloon filled with confetti and small balloons that you can hang up in your living room or at home and then um, at midnight or at nine or whenever you want to ring in the new year, um, you can pop the balloon and a balloon burst flurries out, um, kind of like your own little balloon drop. Yeah, okay, so you're gonna kind of show us what goes into it, how you make it. And I thought, so you said there's about 20-ish little balloons in here as well as confetti. Uh, you blow the little balloons up inside that balloon. I do, yes, yeah. <laughs> um, so I, you know, add in confetti. You can also order them without confetti. Um, well, they you might as well have some confetti, yeah, right? It's New it. Year's Eve. It does make a mess, but <laughs> that's the fun. And so this is this is specifically a New Year's pop drop, uh, but you also do this for first days of schools, for birthday parties. Yeah, so I do them and I can theme them and personalize them. So I'll do them for a birthday party, um, you know, so the birthday boy or girl can pop them, um, you know, on their birthday or first day of school, um, a little thing for the kids to hold up and then you can, you know, after the first day, blow it up. Something about oh, nice. kids in balloons, but just a fun little bit of celebration, huh? Yeah, it's fun. It adds something unique and different. I think for, for the kids or for the adults. Or for the yeah. adults. Okay, okay, so as you continue to do this, I know we do have, I believe, some pictures of uh, past art you do in case people, you know, need some balloon art year round. They can kind of be inspired by the kinds of creations that you make. Uh, you've been doing this for a few years. How fun is it to be part of people's celebration? It's so fun. I, I have two kids. I love birthday parties. I love baby showers. I love all those. I love a themed party. Mm -hmm. um, so it's really fun to get to be with people when they're setting up for the party or helping plan um, little bits because balloons really can bring a, a theme together for a party. Um, so I like it. I like to just be part of that energy. And I don't know if anyone at home has ever tried to make a balloon arch on their own, but it is, and I can't stress this enough, not worth <laughs> Not worth easy. it to it. It's not ever. <laughs> I did at the beginning of COVID. I did my um, turning two-year-old daughters, and um, it took hours. It took, uh, and I did it. I blew them all up without a pump, and it was just <laughs> okay. So we want to uh, hang this up. We're, we have a very special helper to do the yeah, balloon drop. Oh, oh, it's yeah. not blown yeah. up. No, it's oh. not blown up yet. So <laughs> there. I guess <laughs> Okay, perfect. Yeah. Nice. Okay, sweet. And our special helper right over there, we have Elsa. She's two years old. And what she's holding is also, that's a magical wand too, isn't it? She's deciding whether or not she wants to help us. Okay, okay. yeah, we'll hang it right up there. Okay, so you can come either on like a stick to hold it or my favorite way is to hang it from like a command hook or something on the ceiling. Um, it's super easy. Fishing line's the best because it floats and then you just kind of weave it through these balloons. And I have a video that if you order it, you can see the hanging instructions. Okay. Um, really great. Perfect. And then there's Love it. it. Okay, our special helper. Do you guys at home, do you want to help us with our countdown? Okay, Let's do it. New Year's Eve. Here we go. Here we go. 10, Ten nine, 9, 8, eight seven, 8, 7, 6, seven, six, six Five, four, three, two, one. Ready? Oh! That was worth it. Happy New Year! Wow, that exploded. I love that. Oh, that was oh worth it. Oh my goodness, Elsa, great job. That, All that was over. exciting. Okay, <laughs> that's, a big burst. that's a big burst. That was so fun. If people want to order one, what do they need to know? So you can order at my website, um, balloonsbybees.com. And there's a link there to pay, place your order. Um, and then I can deliver within the Sacramento area um, on the 30th, so the Saturday before, or offer pickup um, again in Sacramento um, Saturday or Sunday, the 30th or 31st. 
Thank you yeah. so much. Elsa, good job. Elsa gives that a <laughs> thumbs up. Oh, yeah. did, did you have fun? Yay, good yeah. job. You did a great uh, job. She was also saying the fun thing is, you know, New Year's Eve can happen at any time for you uh, with the pop drop, like us who, you know, set our alarms at like 2.30 in the morning. We're not staying up till midnight. <laughs> or people with kiddos, huh? Yeah. No, yes. <laughs> okay, big round of applause for Elsa. Yay. We'll send it back to you guys. <laughs> that was great. Good job, young lady, and so much fun. Go check them out.